Hi friends, welcome to the next flipped learning video. Um, Mrs. Anderson's supposed to be here, but she had to go pick up some basketballs and she was running late, so hopefully she'll be here soon. But anyway, we're going to talk about uh, subtraction and taking things away. Stories about separating. So, oh, Mrs. Ann? Wow. Oh, hey, sorry I'm late, Mr. Bachman. That's okay. I was out uh, picking up some basketballs from the playground. Some friends left them out there. I so can see. Let's pick them up. Yeah. My goodness, yeah. wow. Oh, gosh. Hey, Miss Sanderson, can I, can I help you out here? Do you yeah. want to take some of these yeah, from I'll you? Yeah, I'll have to go ahead and take here, three of them. Here, let me take, oh. take three of them? Yeah. Okay. Thanks, oh, Miss Sanderson. Hey, no wow. problem. My muscles are starting to shake. I know, I can tell. Yeah. Mrs. Anderson had six basketballs in her hand, and Miss Grant grabbed the three on the top. So how many does Mrs. Anderson have left? One, two. Three. Three! She started with six. Miss Grant took three away. Mrs. Anderson is left with three. Thanks so much, Mrs. Anderson. Yeah, I better go get these back where they belong. So, okay. see you later. Thanks. Bye, Miss Grant. See ya. Hey, Mr. Rockman, what you doing? Oh, hi, Mrs. Anderson. I'm just reading some books and trying to decide what I want to do for Read to Self tomorrow. Oh, that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Hey, could you help me pick some out? Well, sure. What are you looking for? Uh, I think I want to read some on uh, animals. Animals? Okay, well, I have, yeah, I have eight books here. Okay. One. Yeah, this looks good. Um, oh, this one's really good. You'll oh, like that one. Thank you. So you have two of them? Yeah, I got okay. two. Well, how many do I have left? Well, you started with eight, you said. Yeah. And you gave me two. So let's count. So let's count. One, one two, two, three, four, five, six. six. Okay, so I have six books left. That should give me plenty. I think so. Thanks, Mrs. Anderson. Yeah, thanks for sharing. That was nice of you. All right, friends, just to recap, today we talked about stories about separating. We had an example where Mrs. Anderson was carrying the basketballs, and Miss Grant came and took three of them away. It was so nice for her to help. That, that was, was really heavy. nice. She said, yeah, you're not really strong. We were, had an example where we were reading our books. We were all reading together. I was trying to find ones to read for Read to Self, and Mrs. Anderson borrowed two of my, six, of my eight books. I had eight. She took two of them, left me with six. Those are your examples about stories about separating. Now for your challenge. Are you ready? Here we go. By the way, before I tell them the challenge, I want to tell them the reward, because the reward's really sweet. Oh, yeah, If you get the answer right to this question, you get to post on Facebook. What? Post on Facebook. <laughs> what did he say? He said post it on Facebook. Post on Facebook. Facebook. You get the access to my computer, to Mrs. Anderson's computer, and you get to post a message on Facebook to whoever you want, as long as it's appropriate for school, which I know it will be. So, here's your challenge. You must come up with a story problem about separating. Not numbers. What did I say? Not numbers. Not Numbers. Not a numbers. A story problem. A literature problem, if you're so inclined. A story problem about separating. can be anything you want. Bring that to school the next day. We'll check it if it's right. You're posted on Facebook. Anything else? I think that's it. Make sure you get some sleep. Lots of sleep. For yeah. Mrs. Anderson and Mr. Bachman, that's Mr. Stecker. Bye, guys. Good night.